What's up guys? This is Brent with Western Equipment and we are back here with another video in our Mow and Acre series. Today we're going to be mowing with the John Deere X738 with the 60 inch deck. Now a couple of things about the X738 that's going to make it unique. For one, it is going to have a 25 and a half horsepower liquid cooled engine. It's also going to have power steering on it and it is going to be four wheel drive. Now the four wheel drive is not going to be a big deal as you can see with this flat amount of ground that we're mowing, but the power steering could add to the time of this mower because it's going to be a lot easier to make those turns and you can make them a little bit tighter. Now let's talk about our conditions this morning. So this morning we're out here. It is about 82 degrees, pretty humid. This is going to be the second time that we've cut in one week. Normally we do these once a week, but we've had a ton of moisture. So we're going to be out here mowing again today and the grass is going to be about the same length that we had it before. So we are going to set this mower on three looks like we're going to be cutting off about an inch maybe a little more of this grass so what i'm going to do go ahead and hop on the mower start it up let you hear how it sounds then i'll go ahead and start to cut a little strip here then i will turn on the timer start that up and we'll see just how fast and well we can mow this acre now one cool thing about these mowers is this is going to be the largest series of tractor style mowers in the john deere lineup so i'm super excited about mowing with one today so let's go ahead and get started <laughs> All right, now this is gonna be in low idle. We'll go ahead and kick it up so you can hear it. Fairly quiet for high idle. But I'm gonna go ahead and turn those blades on with it at about mid idle here. All right, so now I'm gonna break out the timer. We're just gonna keep on mowing. All right, so before I talk anything about the time, now the time is good, the time is what we would have expected, but the main thing that I would say about these X700s is the ride quality is phenomenal. Now there's nothing special about this seat, this is just gonna be a regular standard suspension seat that comes on these mowers. It's not gonna be the Air Ride or the fancy one at all. And overall, this is the best riding mower that I have done throughout this whole entire series. I was able to keep my foot on the pedal the whole time going over those bumpy sections in this yard even though it looks like a golf course we have those bumpy sections they were not a problem at all today the large rear tires and the large front tires just add phenomenally to the ride quality of this machine and i think the fact that it is also going to be one of the heaviest mowers that we've mowed with helps with that as well so now let's go ahead and get into the time and we had a pretty good time on this mow we were at 28 minutes and 18 seconds so 
we were right at 28 minutes just a touch over with the zero turn we did last we did that z 930m and we had also a 60 inch deck on it but i had problems with keeping it going full throttle the whole time because of how rough the ride was now this machine has a top speed of eight and a half mile an hour the z 930m has a top speed of 10 mile an hour so the fact that we were able to cut this acre at the same height of grass at the in the same amount of time actually just a touch less is pretty phenomenal with this and i think that says one thing is that whenever we are looking into these mowers one thing that we need to consider highly is the ride quality which is why these videos are important so that you can see how that affects the time of your mowing now i know that it's not all about mowing fast so one thing also is that you can see we had a really even cut all the way across this lawn i would say that this machine did a great job on cut quality the 25 and a half horsepower engine did a great job of powering through not only the grass that was on top but also all of those clippings that were laying underneath because whenever we had cut this lawn earlier in the week we cut off quite a bit of grass now we're mowing not only what has grown up but also those clippings as well so that deck is having to handle all of that material so whenever you're thinking about these mowers and you're looking into one keep all of these things in mind keep that ride quality in mind the time that it's going to take you to cut and how much you have to cut and then also how much material that deck can handle so guys i hope this video helped you out i hope that you liked this video if you did we just ask you to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel also guys if you're needing any john deere parts at all make sure to go check us out at 247parts.com and while you're at it go ahead and go check out that mow an acre series playlist check out all the other mowers that we have done in this series so that you can compare and see which mower you need to buy as always guys thanks for watching we'll see you next time hey guys make sure to check out this cool video and this one buy your parts right up here and subscribe right here